Hey everybody, it's Delta Shiny Zeta here, and today I'm bringing you Garden Paws, a game that has been released for Steam, but also very recently, Nintendo Switch. Or at least it's going to be if you're watching this on the day of the video. But this game, first of all, it's developed and published by Bitten Toes Games. Garden Paws was originally released back in late 2018 for specifically Steam, and it actually got a pretty dedicated and loyal fan base. And the game has received a lot of new content ever since. It's a pretty long one already in terms of quests and just how many hours you can pour into this game, but it's gotten even more content recently. So today, I'm bringing you Garden Paws, and I'm playing the Nintendo Switch version, of course, which will come out in just a couple days if you are seeing this. Uh, on, to, on the day that this video is going up. But yeah, here we go. Let's go ahead and start. Play offline, play online. Well, I only have one choice here. I'm gonna go ahead and play offline. I'm not gonna be doing online. New character. So we get to actually make our character. Um, how do I... Oh, I have to use specifically the, uh, the stick. Okay. Change skin. Can I do anything? Wait, can I even do anything? All I really have is Fox. I can change this, the color of it, which is pretty cool. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and change, oh, that's, that's, that's nice. I guess I'll just go with the typical one here, you know, the, the, the mascot. But yeah, it seems like there's, um, oh, there we go, now it's working, okay. I guess it was maybe loading or lagging or something, but now I can change it, okay. I can do cat, I can do dragon. We have bird, horse, I like horse. I like horses, I really do. Um, oh wow, it's really dark. Uh, bear, badger, dog, chipmunk, bunny. I may end up doing cat. I also really like cats. Cats are cool. Alright, I think I'm going to decide what... Oh, should I try it? You know what? I'm going to go with this red one. Sure. I like red as well. Change face. Oh, I can change the face. I don't think I really want to change the face though like I kind of want to go with that iconic one you know oh I see do I want to do that or I'm gonna go with that without the cheeks let's create the character and let's actually begin here create a new world story or creative um, I think I want to go ahead and do story we're gonna create a new world here starting the world but yeah this game is basically I don't know, it's like, it's similar to like Harvest Moon games and stuff like that. It's a bit of like Harvest Moon, a bit of Stardew Valley, a bit of Animal Crossing, a bit of, I guess, Yonder, the Cloud Country Chronicles, because that game is all quests. Lot, lots of quests. It's a very cozy light game, similar vibes to like Cozy Grove, if you know that game. It's a mix of all these things, and I like these like, lifestyle simulation, farming, crafting, questing games, you know? We have a watering can. And we have a, oh my god, it actually is turning pr pretty fast. Whoa, that is a very fast uh, <laughs> sensitivity there. Okay, uh, let's see. So we can go ahead and switch here. Interesting. There's achievements, tutorials. So crafting. See, crafting is going to be a big thing about this game. We can actually craft a bunch of stuff. Here's the map, which is pretty freaking humongous, if you ask me. I did not mean to actually do that. Oh, minus a screenshot mode. Okay. We don't really want that. Huh. And that's pause. We can go into settings there. We can change ambience music, whatever. Grid placement. Uh, smooth camera. Sure. Oh, this is actually what I was talking about. Um, this, we may actually want to go ahead and... Um, move? Wait, but it's not actually... I don't know if the game is lagging or if it's actually because... No, like, it's actually not letting me. Hmm. Change it. Oh, oh, it's the right stick. Very odd decision there. Okay. Uh, so you use the left stick to go down and the right stick to actually move it left and right, which is very strange. Uh, we're gonna do that, I guess. We'll just go... We'll go back. You can always say, get unstuck. <laughs> Sorry, it's just funny that it's, you know, that, that's just so funny. Okay, we're going to exit our home, and we're going to see what we can actually do here. I'm Frank. I manage all the construction work in town. Your grandparents asked me to fix up your home before they left. 
Could you collect 10 pieces of wood for your shop sign and then you'll be set to open your shop at 12 p.m.? You can pick them up in the ground or craft an act in the crafting menu. Um, okay. <clears throat> sure, sorry, my throat is... I gotta clear my throat here a little bit. Alright, so I can collect the wood. Awesome. That's three, that's four. Here we go, five. Did I just watch by... Oh, we got some uh, daisy, daisy seeds. Okay, sure. Uh, you can jump with B. That's good to know. Setup? Let me actually wait and do the other thing first. There's another one there. And... Where's the rest of the wood? What was that? I got a wood from somewhere. I didn't even see it. Lots of daisies and daisy seeds. Open trash can. Items placed in the trash can will be destroyed. Okay. Good to know, good to know. Wait, I guess if you ever get stuck, you can actually just, like, get unstuck. Which is so funny. What was that? Oh, more, more daisies? Achievement unlocked. Gatherer. Nice. Check your mail. Uh, let's read this. Welcome to Florence. Our town is small for now, but with your help it will grow. There are people wanting to join our town every day, but we need houses and shops for them first. Everyone is excited to meet you. We hope you enjoy your time here. Mayor Wilson. Okay, sure. Let's open this chest. Nothing in there. That's just for storage, I guess. Um, Alright, let's go ahead and deliver this. Hey, thanks a lot. Your shop is all ready to open. If you need any other work done around your farm, my shop is just inside of town and on the hill. See ya. Then he just walks off. Okay, awesome. So, what is this here? This is your shop table. You can place items you want to sell here. You can open your shop every day between 12 and 18. I don't have any items. I'm gonna have like... Daisies and stuff like that. Let me actually see these buttons. So if we press Y, we can go to inventory. We can hold... That's ZR. Okay. That's just... That's just tutorials and stuff like that. That makes sense. That makes sense. Alright. This is your shop sign. You can open your shop every day by flipping the sign between 12 and 18. Make sure to fill your table with items to sell. Shop can only open between 12, 12 and 18. Yeah, I got it. Okay, I'm just kind of seeing all of the uh, different controls right now. And seeing what actually, you know, does something. Can I get this rock? No, I cannot. But yeah, B is to jump. Why is the inventory... Okay, so the, the stuff that I picked up, by the way, are actually, they can be found down here. Daisy and Daisy Seeds. So we may actually want to go ahead and want to dig the soil. You can plant a seed in the soft soil. Uh, yeah, that's the plan. Plant seed. Make sure to water the seed every day. Of course, of course. Uh, we're gonna, we're gonna put some more here. I guess we'll just put them like that. Put the daisy seeds in there. Whoops, I didn't mean to do that. Then we got a water. I don't think we have any water. Make sure to water the soil once they disappear. Wait, is that being watered? Yeah, it totally is. They're at half. That's what it's showing up as. Um, in terms of getting more water... We'll have to see later. How that actually works. We can go exploring for a little bit to see if we can find some stuff. Open outhouse? Not sure what that's for either. Okay, and then we can always just go to our uh, map by checking. It is it is a humongous world. Like, it is so big. There's always just so much to do. Alright, uh, there's uh, bigger logs over here alongside the ocean. Can't do much with those right now, though. Kind of just, you know, exploring a little bit here to see what we can actually find. Here's some daisies and daisy seeds. What is this for here? That's stone. That's something new right there. That is... Blueberry. 
collect trash. We got some sand. Alright, so we're definitely filling up very quickly here with all these different items. Let's check on this side, if we can find anything. I mean, there's no quest right now that we're going to have. You can always just check your quest by going here. Quest lock, pending and done. Yeah. Oh, we got 50 coins by doing that. I didn't even notice that. We can definitely craft stuff. Wooden pole. Okay, we can we can we can actually press down to move the way that it actually looks here. Um, wooden block. I mean, it basically tells you. So like, oh wow. So you would need four. Like if I were to select this, I would need five wood, or I need four wood for that. Interesting. This all does. I mean, it makes a lot of sense. Typical, you know. Oh, look at that! There's a thing right there. Can I grab it? Open chest. Chest contains eight daisies. Wait, what? I, I thought I. What? Move to inventory. I did it, right? Yeah, totally gone. So, in here... Oh, I, I see. I mean, we have eight and then we have five right there, too. Over here looks like a dead end. Yeah, definitely. We are currently... Wow, okay, we're right along right there. Alright, that's about it for this side. It is actually about to turn 12 o'clock now, so we can actually, um... Oh yeah, look at that. So you do actually have a, a limit in the water. And you can't jump from the water either. I tried, it did not work. The shop can be open in half an hour. Sweet. Here's all my daisies and stuff. I mean, I guess I should plant more of them. I suppose it's not a bad idea. Dig soil. Dig soil. Dig soil. Oh, I had the wrong I had the wrong one. Daisy seed. Daisy seed. And daisy seed, okay? So yeah, watering them, it fills it up by I would say half. Like the the green bar. Uh then we can go in here, I suppose, and we can set up all right, let's see if this works here. We're gonna... Wait, we're gonna grab... Put them there. All right, there's that. Achievement unlocked. Open for business. I have, I'm selling 10 daisies. Come buy my daisies. <laughs> Again, this is all completely blind. I do not know anything about this game, so it's, it's a learning experience. Definitely is. Um, if I can just sit here. Here's somebody. Somebody's coming. Come buy my stuff. I got daisies for sale. You want some? Want some daisies? What? What the heck? You don't want my daisies? Come on, it's a very, it's a shop full of variety. Come on. There's so many options that you have here in this shop. Okay, nobody wants daisies. I don't think anybody wants any daisies. Nobody's buying them. What about you? Am I supposed to be doing something? No, right? I don't think so. What if I, like, put... Oh, wait, oh, there we go, there we go, they're buying them. What? Oh, there we go. So I actually have to be here during this time. Okay, what if I put, um... Shoot, I'm trying to figure this... Oh my god, get... Oh.
the I'll, I'll be I'll just be honest the whole moving around cycling is not very I don't even know how to describe it it's not very intuitive like if I want to grab an item here can you not move stuff from here like I'm it's also lagging a lot at times okay you have to specifically move to container I mean you can grab it but moving to containers is much easier Alright, sell that for 10. Sell that for 10. Oh, the blueberry was sold pretty much immediately. I don't think anybody would want to buy freaking sand. There you go, I'm getting some money. Getting lots of money. Alright, um, any more, any more? I, mean, I don't really have any more items that I can go ahead and put. Like, would anybody actually want. Well, I guess I can put that right there and stack them. Does anybody want sand? I don't think anybody wants to buy sand. Oh, actually, somebody did just buy sand. Twelve, twelve. Hmm. I mean, I'm making a lot of money here. That's good. Keep selling. This is so cute. This is actually really, really cute. I haven't really, you know, mentioned that, but it, it is actually incredibly cute. I love this. Buy some stuff. Still got three and eight. There we go. Let's see, I should actually be doing more stuff while people are actually doing this. Um, I just don't want to venture out too far, you know? There we go. I think next of all, I'll go that way. I haven't explored stuff over there. I also don't know how to get more quests unlocked. Oh no, there were only two coins. It's because I think I sold them at the same time, so the game said 12, because I sold a daisy and sand at the same time. Yeah, see, those are only two. Daisies are a little bit more, though, so that's pretty good. That I'm making some, making some business over here. So it's always from, I think, what, 12 to 18 is what it was saying? Okay. Hmm. Here's some more stuff. Daisy seed and daisy. Here's something. Flint. That's something new. More daisy seed and daisy. Uh, up here we got some wood. That's not bad. Let's check back over here. There's probably a bunch of people here waiting in line. Oh yeah, definitely. I don't know if they ever move though. I guess not. And that's it. That's it, people. I'm sold out. I'm, I'm officially sold out. I mean, I can put more stuff in there, but I don't know if I want to. Because it may be more beneficial to, like, stock up on more stuff instead and explore out of here. Here's some wood. I'll take the wood. That's plus two wood. And then, let's see what else. We shall... We're gonna hear this no Oh wait, did I just walk through something? Plant fiber. Oh wow. I'm just mashing the A button here. We're getting up. Small insects? Whoa. You can get so much plant fiber from there. Got some stone, more daisies, more wood. There's so much stuff here. Okay, so we are clearing out this place full of items. That's a whole bunch of plant fiber that we got. Ooh, I walked through something. Oh, sand pile. You could barely tell. Okay, then there's more sand here. Yeah, we'll take this. Shop close. Earn 168. That sounds pretty good, I guess. For it being the first day. 
I also do like that your character actually does walk pretty fast. It's like you can actually get around fairly quickly between different places, which is really nice and convenient. Just grabbing everything that I see. Got some more flint right there. Anything else in here? What is this? This looks important. Message in a bottle one. Okay. So where the hell are we now on the map? Because I honestly don't even know anymore. Um... Oh wait, no, this is our house. I thought it was another house. We just did a full circle. I didn't think about it first until I saw these freaking daisies. I was like, wait a minute. So we did just do like a full circle around. That was nice. Um, okay. I don't know what the heck we're actually doing next. I mean, that was a... Uh, that was a pretty good, uh, pretty good first day, I would say. Should I just maybe call it early? I guess I can call it early. Let's, let's go in here and see how this works. So like, if we go here, and then we go to bed... Daily stats, 20 items sold, whatever, okay. Wild crops harvested 38, quest completed 1. Okay. New day. So, I mean, there's a lot of quests in this game, and I want to see how you actually unlock these. If it's just like a day-by-day -day thing. Hey, I stopped by your shop yesterday, it looks really great. Do you take requests for large orders? I'd like 10 daisies. Um, okay. It's a special order, huh? So I just need one daisy. What is this? Oh, I thought that was actually something. Okay, here's my tenth daisy, so I'll actually go ahead and give this to you. And we got 140. Cool. Let's check our mail here. Uh, read. Hey kid, I'll go exploring. Go find lots of flowers and seeds. Once you get some seeds, use the hoe to dig a hole and plant the seed. Make sure you water it every day so it can grow, then sell the flowers in your shop for a profit. That's what I've been doing. Or that's what I'm going to do, I should say. We have a lot of um, seeds, though. We really do. So it sounds like your water is just infinite. You don't have to fill it up. At least I don't think so. Oh, wait. There was a freaking thing right there, dude. I, I walked so far. Um, okay, we're going to go here. And I guess we just got to do a lot. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight, nine, sure. Then we gotta plant them all. There's a lot of daisies. Now, they better give me more than one, because if they only give you one, I don't know if it's all that worth it, because, like, you can get these so much faster if you just go out and forage, you know? So, like, I feel like the payoff should be that if you're waiting multiple days to get a daisy, it should give you more than one daisy, you know? But we'll see. We'll see how this works. Oh, that one's already watered. Okay, so I think we watered them all. I think we're set. What the heck? This thing goes screw right in front of our house. That's crazy. Um, alright. Let's see what else we can actually find around here. We can actually cross the bridge, and we probably should. Yeah, I think we should do that. Because as far as our... Let's take a look at this again. Wow, look at all that. 38 plant fiber? Wow. Okay, um... So this is gonna take us over to the island on the left side. And apparently there's a lot of people over here on this island. Like, a lot of shops and stuff. So we will see what we can actually find. There's also a lot of plant fiber here. These are all plant fiber. We also get plant fiber seeds. Message in a bot. Oh, yeah, I should actually take a look at those. Uh, let, let's see. How do I... Oh, I guess I can't do anything with them. Hmm. That's weird. I thought it literally was like a message in a bottle that we can read. Okay, I'm gonna take all these... Take the sand, more sand. 
There's a lot of sand over here that we can get. There's a huge amount of it. And we're also just taking all this plant fiber. We have a humongous amount of this now. Here we got some blueberries. Okay. Uh, there's something blue there. What is this? St oh, wait. Just, what the hell? That looks very different. Never mind. It's just stone. Purchase this one bedroom house for 5,000 coins. What? Definitely not anywhere close to that. That's for sure. What is this one? 5,000. So they're both just going for five. Whoops, wrong button. They're both just going for 5,000, it seems. Um, Alright, let's keep going. These are all just going to be able to be purchased. Yep, another one for five grand. Message in a bottle. Did I walk through that? Yep, some stone. I'm emptying this world of plant fiber. I'm gonna make this plant extinct. Give me these blueberries. Okay. I mean, we're slowly making our way over there to the... All the different buildings. Oh, there's more sand over here. I guess I should take this. I mean, there's plenty of it. I don't really need to be taking literally every single one that I find, but it would be nice to do it. It's also about to be 12, close, so I should actually, um... Maybe also head back and make my shop, I don't know. Here's the town. Alright, well, we made it. Let's see what what's actually in here. Can we enter any of these? I don't think we can. <laughs> Can't even go there. Oh, great. Shop can be open in an hour. Oh. I see. And that goes for all of these, I guess? That one didn't really give a prompt. Only the other one gave a prompt. Oh, wait, no, 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 it was saying my shop. Sorry, it was just so convenient or so, so coincident. Oh my god, look at all these things here. Hey, I'm Boris, my brother is Clovis. I can solve all your storage needs, from backpacks to chests, we have them both. Come see me if you ever need storage solutions. When we get a costume shop built in town, you'll be able to meet Clovis, my brother. See you around. Completed quest, meet Boris. That was a completed quest? I keep pressing minus, oh my god. That was considered a completed quest? I guess so. Hi there, I'm Abby, I run the vegetable seed shop. Come see me for all your healthy seed needs. Here's a housewarming present, welcome to town. We got one cabbage seed. Um, wait, but I can't even talk to these people. Oh, increase inventory by five, inventory plus five. That, that looks actually very worth it, once we have the money. Here's, uh, Malu. Hey, I'm Malu. I run the fabric and dyes shop here in town. Here's a little something to welcome you to town. One cloth. How's my inventory looking? Oh, I am actually full. I am full. That's not good. Shop can be opened, but I'm so far. I'm just so far. Oh, okay, so your limit is actually 50, I just realized. Um, not enough space in inventory. Oh, crap. What is this? Oh, oh, that's the thing that dropped. Okay, I see. The surplus. The thing is, these people might actually give me free stuff. And I'm really scared about, you know, talking to them and then wasting the free item that they give me. What I should be doing is going back and selling everything, but either way, I think I'm actually going to be running out of time for this episode really soon, so... Wait, am I going the right way? 
Where am I going? Um, I mean, technically, no, but... Can I go through here? Yeah, I can. I just don't want to talk to any of these people yet because my storage is... My inventory is already full. So I need to figure out... Can I make this? I guess if you start by jumping, yeah. Yeah, let's go, let's go, let's go. We're already a little bit behind here. More stone. Alright, so we just gotta... pick and choose some stuff here that we can sell. Okay. So we got... Uh, we'll do... I guess we should try the... Um, no, no, go up. Go up. See what I'm talking about? There's something kind of weird about the menu wing. It's a little glitchy, I think. Uh, we're gonna move to container. We're gonna um, move to container, and then we'll. What else should we even do? Sand dollar. What the heck is this? Sand dollar. What about small insects? Do people want to buy insects? I don't know, actually. We're just gonna do a whole lot of waiting here. Right now, to just, first of all, to kind of see what these other things are worth it, you know? Alright. Come get something. Ooh, wow. Right off the bat, huh? So those are ten. We already know about the daisies. I mean, they're ten. Simple enough. I guess in the meantime, we can go ahead and do some of this here. Oh, you already want some stuff. Plus five. Plus five. You're all out of energy for the day. Oh, that's the energy meter. Okay, okay, that makes sense. I did see that bar, but I wasn't sure if it was like something time-based or something. No, it's literally your energy meter. Okay. That makes more sense. So I'm just going to wrap up this day with, um, you know, my shop here. Whatever money I make. Whatever I make, I make, you know? And then... I guess I'll just go ahead and sleep and call it a day. And save the game. Yeah, so daisies definitely sell for the most. Plant fiber, I guess, is not bad. I mean, it's selling for, I think, five? What you want? Anything? Yeah, that's ten. I'll take it. I could use the money, for sure. Nobody's really getting the bugs. Actually, they haven't really gotten the other stuff at all. Hmm. Ten... Look at that, everybody wants the daisies. Everyone's just taking the daisies. Because I guess they're very attractive. Insects um, are only five each, which, I mean, that's whatever. It's not terrible like the sand that's worth that two at two value. And then plant fiber is also five. These aren't terrible for now. Those will actually work a pretty fair amount, I would say. Another five right there. I would plant stuff, but like, I don't have any stamina. Or, or water stuff, I should say. I have Plant and water. Unfortunately, unfortunately, there's not really much else I can do. Oh, you're still here? Oh, I thought I... There we go. Like, there's more daisies over here, and I guess I can, like, get them. Sure. Oh my god. It takes energy to pick up stuff. That's a first. I've never heard of a Harvest Moon game that actually, you know, I play so many Harvest Moon games. This game is like, oh yeah, actually, foraging takes stamina. Which I guess makes sense, because like if you were trying to, if you were out in the wild, out in the, you know, nature, and you were picking up flowers from the ground, or herbs, or grass, or whatever, that would take energy, right, to like bend down and pick up stuff, and over time you would get tired, so. 
Makes sense. I guess the bigger question is why didn't Harvest Moon games ever do that? That's crazy, right? That's so crazy. Almost done. We got uh, about 40 seconds left here. And I guess we'll just uh, end the video shortly after that. But hopefully this video introduced you to the game a fair amount. Uh, the game is going to pick up a lot more in the next video because we have all those other people to talk to. You know, and all the villagers and stuff. So that's that'll be something for sure that we got to do. But yeah, this was all just introductory stuff. Lots of foraging, planting seeds and stuff. You know, the usual... The usual, the, the, the typical, you know, first video of any, like, farming and questing game, you know? There we go. Iron 165. I guess I can... Can I leave these here? I guess I can. But I need some more attractive stuff for tomorrow. Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna go here and we're gonna end the day. So the game is always being saved automatically every time you sleep. You're going to be ready, and that's going to be it for this video. So before I end this video, don't forget to leave a like, comment, subscribe, and turn on notifications if you enjoyed the video. I will see you all later. Bye-bye, everyone. Have a great day.